going into the postseason, it's almost better to back away a little from the sport. Um, just stay relaxed and, uh, you know, just let your training that you've done for the last 11 months, you know, take care of itself. And uh, just uh, backing away a little bit helps refresh your body and your mind a little bit and, uh, you know, gets you excited to get back on the mat. For the Big Tens and uh, Nationals as the season comes to an end, one of the biggest things I think, um, especially for younger guys, because uh, it happens all around the country, uh, you know, it's such a long season that guys lose focus. And, you know, I think that with as being a captain with some of the other, with the other three guys being captains, we gotta help the team stay focused and uh, prepare well here. Going into the end of the season here, I felt I haven't felt more confident in my training. Personally, I feel like I've wrestled. I'm wrestling right now to the best of my ability. Uh, I haven't felt any. I haven't felt better in any of my matches in any of the history that I've had. And I just feel like I am capitalizing on all my previous mistakes. Uh, going into the postseason, I think it's it's more of an honor than anything to keep wrestling. A lot of people are done after this next weekend. We set our sights high. We want to win those Big Ten titles and those national titles. So our focus is obviously winning the national title, but we still have to, coaches are great at getting us to peak at the right time. Some of the training we're doing right now, this first week before Big Ten, is just you know, a lot shorter practices, more intense. And uh, as we get into next week, we're gonna try and you know emulate the, the idea of the Big Ten tournament being two hard days in a row more or less focused on intensity instead of duration of practices. We don't have these long drawn out practices or these enduring practices, but we're in and we're out. And everything's intense, we're working on, we're working on uh, crisp moves, crisp techniques. In postseason tournaments, I, I like to keep my head on straight by just thinking that each tournament is the same as the previous tournament. I mean, just because it's postseason doesn't mean it's like any more emphasis, even though it really is, but you can't dwell on on things that have happened in the past and stuff like that. So you just gotta treat it like a new tournament and new opportunity to succeed. I think one of the biggest things is that you're in the right place mentally. You know, you gotta you gotta believe in yourself, believe that you're gonna go into the tournaments, both Big Tens and Nationals, and come away with a championship. And for me last year, that was a big thing, just going in there, believing in myself and being ready, thinking that I could go in and win. And so it's the same thing this year, just treating your body right. The coaches, they do a great job of getting us feeling great, ready to go before the tournament that, that whole week or two leading up to it. And so just take that, you know you're gonna be feeling good and you just gotta believe in yourself. You know, we're all getting, you know, that idea of being intense and uh, we want guys to just, you know, not not really get have nerves because uh, you know we train so hard and you know focus all year long and you know being intense and this is the moment you know we want to be ready for. Go out there and wrestle the same way we have all year. There's no reason to really change our style, change anything about it. We're just going to go out there and compete and win those close matches and try to dominate the ones that we're favored at. I think in tournament situations, it's 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 very similar to a duel where each guy's really got to worry about themselves. And uh, if they worry about themselves, then uh, you know, the team will take care of itself. Like, NCAA is an individual tournament, Big Tens is an individual tournament, but for the team to be at its best, um, each guy really has to worry about himself. No matter what people say, it's still an individual sport. You got, we won the team title as a team. Each guy contributed to that, but in the end, coming into these Big Ten and national tournaments, it's an individual aspect. If each guy does their part, then we're gonna win the title. One of the things that we're gonna have to focus on as a team as funny as it sounds, focusing on this as a team is focusing on ourselves. If we all, if we all, if we're all greedy in a sense, and we all want the best that we can do, we can all try to put ourselves on the podium, put ourselves up on top. That in itself will do the best that any, out of anything to do for our team. If we're all trying to win titles and score points for ourselves, that's going to be a great turnover. I think bonus points will be huge, if, uh, especially team like Penn State that's got guys that are real capable of getting those pins, those bonus points. We gotta be able to match those guys. I think there's a lot of weights that we're gonna place higher than them, but if we can win win a couple of the titles that we're supposed to and then perform a little above our seats and some of the other weights, there's no reason we shouldn't be on top.